week was fantastic, too. You may feel like uh, pulling out your favorite beverages for spring and summer. I mean, it is kind of white wine season. Well, that's just it. With all this really fabulous weather, the, the barbecue grills are in high gear. Yeah. So we wanted to bring you a selection of wines yes. that would be ideal with our grill favorites. This is Linda Chauncey, by the way. You're, what's your official title? Director of Education. At uh, Sato Saint-Michel, one of our very favorites. I love hearing that. You are going to play a little bit of a game with us I to am. help folks at home decide what the right wine for them might be. Yeah, this is going to help. And okay. you guys, actually, there's a little competition. Your viewers need to know neither Travis nor Bill have any clue nope. which wine is in these tumblers. Okay. Don't know. We, it just happens to be one of these. <laughs> so they're going to help us guess what variety is in the glass. And, and gentlemen, we're going to start from left okay. to right. Okay. And, are you, and you're going to hold up the card. When you think All you've right. identified this variety, what we know for sure is we have a rosé, we have a Pinot Noir, a dry Riesling, and yes, not all Rieslings are sweet, and we have a Cabernet. Okay. And are you ready? I'm yeah. so right. ready. All right. I'm all right. All right. I'll count the points. <laughs> all right. Ready, set, okay. go. All right. All right. All right. Travis is on you. Uh, and Travis got it at first. One point for Travis. You are oh. correct. So you can get a half a point, Bill. All right. Feel sorry. All right. Yeah, rosé. And you know what? This is our 14 hands rosé. I love it. It's in a it can. Is, you love it? Yes. It is so convenient. Oh. I mean, this is all about oh. cool is biking, that? hiking, yeah. Yeah. Boating. camping, right. boating. Yeah. And as my uh, dear friend says, I think I just found a new garden buddy. I love it. That's <laughs> yeah. fantastic. You love it? Isn't that great? Put it in a little cozy and like... Uh, there you go. You know, well, or garden. your gardening holster, right? All of the above, yes. <laughs> Fantastic. Isn't that delicious, I love too? It. Yeah. yeah. It's so tasty. All right, yeah. gentlemen. Lovely. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. I'm ready. All right. Wine number two. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Too fast on the draw. Well, I mean, it's a game, right? Wait. Okay. That. Yeah. Are you? You're, okay. So it's one to one. But Riesling, right? Yeah. Oh. Wasn't it delicious? Mm. Yes, yeah. I was expecting some sweet, but there's like citrus in it. Like it's a lovely, right, fresh, right. like, mm. There's some pe great peach. But the point is, is that people think that all reasons are sweet. And indeed, yeah. some are, and we love them. Right. But this is dry, ideal with oysters on the half shell, yeah. also grilled brats, wonderful stuff. Shout out to St. Michelle Dry Riesling. All right, he's ahead of you. <laughs> I'm going to have to hold your hands back now. All right, gentlemen, this is where wine tough, number though, though. three, wine number three. Are you ready? Okay. Yeah, this will be tough. They've got two reds in case they're peeking in their tumblers. We got a Pinot Noir and a Cabernet. Oh, Travis I was wrong. Travis oh! would be correct. Mm -hmm. that he, well, let me guess that, what the last one is. What do you think is? the last one is? <laughs> but wait a minute. Wait a minute. We should drink it first. Yeah. Oh, no, but wait, you know, I want you to go back. I asked the director of education. If you taste this Cabernet, you'll see how much lighter this is. There's some delicious acidity, some... some Wonderful pomegranate cherry fruit in this. This is Erath Pinot Noir from Oregon. Mm. It's Oregon Wine yeah. Month. Erath is the leader in production of Pinot Noir. Um, it and smells like spring. I mean, like it's gorgeous. Well, I love that. Yeah. And and you know, part of it is this is the perennial favorite with grilled salmon. Yeah. Yeah. Now, Bill, did you try the last one? I wine? did. I did. I cheated. Oh, and, and no, I, I wanted you to. Yeah. And yeah. There we go. It's a, it's a it's a tie. It's a tie. It's a tie. So the last one, wow. did you try it? No, Travis, you have to try this. <laughs> you know why I love this wine? This is our Columbia oh. Crest Horse Heaven Calvin, uh, mm. Cabernet Sauvignon. And this wine, you know, a survey was recently done, and it said that 60% of people polled said that their go-to wine was Cabernet. And this wine delivers why. To me, this is juicy and soft and round, but obviously great with grilled foods. I mean, the yeah, hamburgers, yeah. The, just all the traditionals, right? And Horse Heaven Hills. I mean, it feels like it's just full of sunshine. Like, I love the Horse You've Heaven Hills. You've been there. It's such a gorgeous appellation. Is I, that the one? Appel yes. What's the right word? Your AVA. There we go. Yeah, you yeah. No, no, appellation, AVA, it's all the same. No, I'm gorgeous. very... Gorgeous. Like I mean, because mm. that was going to be my tiebreaker is why is this called H3, but... Because you have a tie, but he just he just won. Oh no, he no, he's he's yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, Horse I, Heaven I, Hills. <laughs> it's, it is you a did it. Wine. All of them are gorgeous wines, really. Truly. Thank you. Yeah. Thank I, you. Guys I, are good sports. I want a rematch. I know we should. And I want some I know, more right? wine. So <laughs> I, I guess that's the wine. thing. So we'll have to well, wait, have you call, back, call, and then we'll have a we'll, rematch. Okay. Perfect. There we go. I'm here. Awesome. And we can learn Thank a you. lot more about your wines and some advice on wines and lots of things on the Sato Saint Michel website. website. Yeah, which is Saint -E Michel. Yes. Is that how? Dot com. Dot com. Fabulous. Yes. Fabulous. Awesome. Very much. Linda, Thanks Thank for you, Travis. Here. All Thank right. You, Thank you. All right. MJ, let's check in with you. Well, just cloudy.